What up you guys, it's Sunday, how you guys doing? Y'all doing good? I'm doing good. I am headed out to Costco. Um, I didn't get that much actually because I just went to Costco last weekend. So um, I just need to restock up on a few things. So I got this right here. This is Angie's um, Kettle Corn, Angie's Kettle Corn. I tell you, this thing is so good. I also got this um, uh, this chicken right here. What is it called again? Rotisserie. There we go. Rotisserie chicken. I also got me some avocado, some grape tomatoes, which is like my new favorite snack right now. Oh crap! I didn't get string cheese. I need to go get string cheese at Target. Um, and also, I got this salad mix. It has sweet kale in it. Um, what else? There's dried cranberries, chow, cabbage, Brussels sprouts, broccoli. It's like a really, it's a good salad mix. And then I went and got this lettuce too. What I like to do, this is a spring mix. I like to mix these two in it. Um, this has sesame seeds. I don't know if I said that. I like to mix these two. And then what I intend on doing is adding my grape tomatoes and my avocados as usual. And then shred up some of this rotisserie chicken, put on top of it. And I also, I ran out of almonds that I usually put on my salad, so I rebought some of those. Also, I bought this here. It is a pasta, uh, it's from Pasta Prima. Prima. There we go. Spinach and mozzarella, 100% natural ravioli. This is amazing. I've been eating this for, I don't know, years and years. My mom used to make it for us. Um, I mean, really, it's gone through different names and different packaging, but it's basically the same thing. I just rediscovered it maybe a few weeks ago. It's not a diet item whatsoever. The reason why I like it, it's really, really easy to make. Waiting on Alice to get back from Birmingham. They're going to go to Zumba today, so really excited yeah, about that. Yeah, at least we are in, um, what's this? New York Company, we're shopping. Look at that. Doing a shopping. We're in our gym clothes, as you can see. We're about to go to Zumba after this. Can't miss Zumba ever. Zumba or die. <laughs> Zumba or die. <laughs> Zumba and we are having the pasta that I showed you guys earlier and a salad that I put together. The salad says this is mine. The only difference between ours is mine has a little bit of that roastery chicken on it. Alice doesn't eat chicken at all. Um, she doesn't eat fish, but she doesn't eat chicken. So um, there are the almonds and a little bit of cheese I added and avocados and grape tomatoes. So this is going to be really, really Hey guys. Hey guys. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, it's kind of blurry. Oh, that light that I guess. Yeah, I think it's the uh, glare or whatever. Anyway, we're on our way to work, and we're going to have a good night, right? We are. <laughs> claiming it. We're claiming a good night. Um, so to, we work tonight. Tomorrow we're off, and um, what are we doing tomorrow? We're going to go to the movies. We're going to finally see Divergent. We still haven't seen it. Right. Alice has even started. Um, so you show them. Insurgent, Insurgent with the second book. Yeah, in the series. And hopefully, she looks like she's almost halfway, so when she's done, I'm going to start it. But I just want to thank you guys for being so nice um, on last week's vlog. I was reading the comments, and a lot of you guys were concerned about Brian sent prayers this way. So we appreciate that a lot. All right, hey guys. Alice and I are going to go get our coffee and our tea. First night without our special little lady downstairs, so hopefully it's not a fail. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, it's okay. Mine definitely passed the taste test. Not as good as Mary's, but it's still all right. Close. Close. So we just left Applebee's, and now we're headed to the mall to get me some new sneakers. I know, right? Way overdue. Forty dollars. Look, these are a lot more reasonable. And paying ninety dollars for shoes. Sketches. Look, this is the same thing you have. That's not. It is. What is it really just saying? <sighs> yeah, that's the same thing you have, right? No. It looks similar. Alice has some really nice sneakers, so I'm trying to get something like hers. You know, the ones that look like mine are the same price. Seventy dollars, but not ninety dollars like at Foot Locker. I ain't nobody got time for that. Look, this is, well, not like that. I actually like this. To be honest, I like that. 
Let me try some of these things on. What size is yours? Nine? Mm-hmm. But yours feet are smaller than mine. The only reason why I got a nine is because they didn't have eight and a half. <laughs> I actually like the way that nine and a half felt better. And then theater together. Elderly. Elderly. <laughs> Couples come to the movie theater together. I think it's so cute. All right, so we're at the movies. We are, we are finally going to go see Divergent. So, yeah, let go. Anyway, I got my shoes. Uh, maybe I'll show you guys a little later what my sneakers look like. Ready? Their disorder Yeah, we have the whole movie theater to ourselves. I can see you. It's only us. I know, but we'll check with you guys later and let you guys know what we thought about the movie. All right, guys, so let's tell you guys what happened right now okay so alice and i are in the movie theater we are watching we're we were all by ourselves like we like we uh told you guys earlier we were watching all the previews and i get a call from work okay and i'm thinking they're trying to call me into work but i look at the time and i'm like it's a little too late for them to be calling me into work let me just pick it up to see what's going on maybe with some, you know something with one of the patients that i took care of last night and i was like you know maybe somebody has a question so i went ahead and picked up the phone and um, she's like, hey, Patricia. I'm like, hey, she said, did you know that you were on the schedule tonight? And I was like, uh, no. So Allison, I had to leave the movie theater, get a refund, and now I'm heading home to put my clothes on and go to work. Now, mind you, I didn't get to bed till about 9.30 this morning. And we had to wake up at, well, I was up at like t a little bit after 12 sucks for me so I'm about to head on head on uh, home and change and try to make it to work well people here I go I'm at work coming up the elevator I just pray I have a good night because I ain't up for the foolishness all right guys so the struggle is so real right now it's not even funny so 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 real so I did take time to braid my hair up I've been doing um, braid outs the last few days. So I took a melatonin, a three milligram melatonin. This one's from Nature's Bounty. And mel melatonin, you know, your body naturally releases it when it's bedtime. Um, particularly, you know, when the sun goes down and, and your body's recognizing that it's time to wind down. I also have my, um, eye band that I put over my eyes. I have a lot of trouble sleeping during the day. I don't know if this is something I expressed to you guys before. My, I, it's something that my body just cannot get used to. So I do wake up a whole lot during the day. I'm trying to do better with helping to take the melatonin so my body knows that it is nighttime and it's, well, nighttime and it's time to go to bed. Also, creating darkness with these with this eye um, mask or whatever that I got at Walmart also helps too. Even though I really shouldn't need any help today, but you see how alive and awake I am after, you know what I'm saying, what happened last night? So... I have to put this on and try to attempt to sleep. And the sleep was rough, but well needed. I could definitely use more, though. <laughs> um, so I'm just chilling right now, watching some YouTube videos and um, eating. Let me show you guys what I'm watching and eating. This is Ghana Princess 05. And actually, you see this lipstick she's wearing? I don't know if you guys can see how pretty it is through the camera. It's gorgeous. I actually just went over to MAC. <laughs> and put it in my cart. It's right here. I just kind of keep a cart at MAC and when I have the money to spend on the makeup, I'll buy it. So I went ahead and put it in my cart because <laughs> it was so pretty on her. So I was watching her vlog. Um, this one right here is Socialite Life TV, her vlog. Um, as well, I'm getting ready to watch. And it's Judy's Life's vlog. I'm also getting ready to watch. This is my dinner. It's a whole look. It's in a big salad bowl. Um, and I'm eating all of it. <laughs> it's tomato, um, lettuce, avocado, almonds, rotisserie chicken. So I'm about to put some dressing on it and kill it. You hear me? Kill it. Tonight is my last night of work. So I'll be able to catch up on sleep. And I, I really want to get a video in Thursday for my other channel. I feel like I'm neglecting my other channel. <laughs> I used to do two uploads over there and one upload over here. But I've been doing one in one. But I'm going to go back to doing two videos on my um, other channel. Let me eat, guys. I'm on like a tight schedule in order for me to get out of here by about 6.05-ish. Alright, what's up, guys? I am... 
getting my life together right now. <laughs> so, I made it through my work week. I'm about to finish doing my makeup right now. How y'all doing? Y'all doing good? I'm doing good. I'm looking for my blush right now. Here it is. Um, well, this is not really what I want to use, but I'm going to use it anyway. This is uh, Raisin by MAC. I'm actually getting ready to go to the mall with um, Whitney, my two friends, Whitney and Kanitha. So um, that's kind of why I'm kind of getting my life together. And also I wanted to knock out a video in the meantime. I really am not. This is not the color I was going for. I was going for something a little darker like this. Yes. This is, what is this? Raspberry by... Black Radiance. I still have like my sleep band right here um, from my nap. Let me take it off. It did a good job of keep, uh, keeping my hair away while I was doing my face. What I'm going to do, I'm going to hit y'all with the old school stuff. I'm going to whip out some sheen spray. <laughs> yep, I did it. I did it. I mostly use this to give me some shine. It also smells amazing, okay? And it gives my hair that slip so I can prevent frizz, you know what I mean? A lot of you guys were clowning, those of you guys who subscribed to my other, ch other channel, you guys were clowning me because I didn't like my um, curl former set that I did, right? This is what Patricia likes. Patricia likes, you know, hair that looks slight, like, like I woke up like this, you know what I mean? The only thing I liked is the curl former stretched my hair really nicely. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this video out of the way and um, hang with my girls. I might buy some makeup. We're gonna, probably going to go to MAC. Um, I just left my little date with uh, my friend Kanitha and my friend Whitney. And we went to the mall and I got some things from MAC. I got to tell you this. We had so much fun at MAC. You know, Whitney's, Whitney's Caucasian and Kanitha is from Thailand. And... I basically had so much fun trying different lipsticks on them because they're very conservative in their lipstick picks. So for those uh, of you MAC lovers, I made Whitney by um, Lady Danger, Vegas Vault, which is one of my favorite colors, and what else? There was one other lipstick. Not Ruby Woo, there was another one. She didn't like Ruby Woo. I know, right? Blasphemy. Flat out fabulous, which it didn't have at the counter, so she had to order it online. So, yeah. It was so cool seeing the different lipsticks on them and everything. They always make me do bad things, okay? So we went out to eat. Of course, we didn't pick anything healthy, even though all of us are on diets. You know what I'm saying? All of us are working out, trying to do better with our lives, right? So, we ended up going to this place called Mellow Mushroom. And please holla at me if you have gone to this place before there's one right across the street kind of where i live but there's another one out here in this area called jones valley and um but we were closer to jones valley um than we were the one by my um, apartment complex so we came out here and let me tell you something i've heard about it but i hadn't eaten it so good oh my gosh they have like pizza calzones hoagies that type of thing but it's so fresh. Everything's homemade. Everything is all natural, fresh. Like, oh my gosh, it was so good. So I have like half of my, of course, because I couldn't eat the whole calzone. I have half of my calzone left. And oh my gosh, I enjoyed it so much. The marinara that came with it was so good. Like, amazing, guys. Like, honestly, amazing. Now, since there's one right by my house, I'm going to be in trouble because I'm going to want to you know what I'm saying? Go to this place. If any of you guys have been to Mellow Mushroom before, I don't know if it's just a southern chain or if it's just in my town. I haven't looked it up just yet to see what other places have it. But if you've been to a Mellow Mushroom before, holler at me down below. What's your favorite dish? What up, peoples? It's Friday. Happy Friday. Alice is coming up behind me. I don't know if you can see her. But um, Alice and I are going shopping. Uh, I don't think I told you guys this yet, but next weekend is um alumni weekend for our alma mater and um it's a huge weekend in town i mean all the hotels are sold out you know all these different people come in town let me give you guys a quick background of my school so you guys understand me just a little better 
I went to a uh, attended, Alice and I attended, we graduated different years obviously, but Alice and I attended a historically black institution. And um, the institution also happens to be a Christian influenced affiliated institution as well. So we had, like I said, an amazing college experience. I said that, I said that in our last video. Um, loved it. I met so many wonderful, talented, beautiful, amazing people. I went to a school where before we took a test, we prayed. We prayed together. You know, our teachers were rough. They didn't cut us any slack, but you know what? At least they called on the name of the Father before they decided to give us, you know, the hardest test of our lives. You know what I'm saying? I will give you guys more info on that next week because it will be included in next week's vlog. So right now we're just doing the initial preparation and things like that. We are at Route 21 right now, and there's Lisi over there shopping. Oh, isn't that the cutest thing? The funny thing is, I bought the black version of this jacket and I returned it because I didn't feel comfortable spending $30 on it. Guess how much it is now? Seven. Good morning, guys. It is Saturday morning. How you guys doing? We are headed to church right now. There's Lisi. And um, yeah, it's a beautiful day here in Northern Alabama. It's about, about 80 degrees today. So it's gonna be really, really beautiful. I love to hear from you guys. And yeah, guys, I'll see you guys next time in another video. Love you guys.